گروشکو برگادا با درانش داشت جنگلار بیش دا درد گادا لارنز وین باشکا دا گابارا ایش با دار گاگالا اترا برا And on top of all that, it gets 90% of the stains out 100% of the time. It's incredible. Man, I miss this air. It's so dank. The human body is a work of wonder, agility, strength, dexterity, Body odor. As amazing as the human body is, sometimes it smells like <laughs> Unfortunately, some people haven't learned that yet. For those moments, you inevitably find yourself facing down a smelly man-child. We've got the solution for you. Introducing Jank Stank. The first anti-person perspirant of its kind. Jank Stank is an all-in-one deodorant, fertilizer, chemical weapon that will keep your magic tournament smelling fresh AF. Just open, aim, and spray at any stinkies you find. Reap the rewards. And game on. What are you waiting for? Jank that stank. Thanks, Jank Stank. Tim, I brought you a shirt. Thanks, Joe. Since you're literally incapable of ever winning. Joe, did you bring me something? Nope. Hang on, did you just bring something back from earth yeah i guess that's weird now that you mention it we've convened i see tim where'd you get that shirt uh uh this one uh the wheelmaster gave it to me oh that, that was very kind let's see what game type you must reckon with today wheelmaster spin the wheel of Sealed Brawl One War Free Release Kit Four Dominaria Boosters One Champions of Kanegawa Booster One Pack of Fallen Empires Build a 60 card Brawl deck from your pool Eradicate the competition Victor gets one month in the real world Sick Tight Cool As an added treat You'll each get one bonus booster Pulled from the hat which was taken. 
Betrayers of Kamigawa. Dominaria. Nice. <laughs> All no fighters. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Well, I think I know which one I'm getting anyway. It's the Saviors of Kamigawa. I'm gonna start with some down here. Next. Yargle. Alright, here comes the promo. Nissa, who shakes the world. That's a nice. good one. That's a really good one. Fibble Flip! Yes! yes. Okay. That, there's your commander right there. <laughs> Karn, Creator, and Mawu. Nice. Little well, companion. Little cute. I'll show you that. Uh, Kiora. Kiora. Yeah. To fairy time raveler. Nice. Rogue Shadow Mage. Cue yeah. it! Yeah. the blood cloaked. Cool. I'll go next. Sweet. Arvad. <laughs> Flashbacks. Yeah. Arvad. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Some Boda. Oh. <laughs> My promo is... Arlen. Ar okay. That's the... And oh, Mizium Tank. 
That's pretty good, actually. That's... I chose Feather as my commander. Feather was clearly the most powerful commander in my pool. Given that White was also strong, I thought it was a pretty obvious choice. I even had three Defiant Strikes. Tim reminded me that I can only have one in my Singleton Brawl deck. So I chose Ashiok as my commander. a lot of strong removal in black and blue so I figured I would amass with my sorceries and build up a defense so that I could win with Bolas's Citadel. My commander is Kiora. I was tempted to go into white due to my heavy removal suite and a board wipe and to fairy, but I didn't feel like I had a way to finish the game. So instead I went with the two best colors in commander according to some idiots. I mean, I had a lot of really good options and I really had to weigh them all, but... Um, the Dragon God. Go ahead. Draw for turn. Swamp, pass. Draw. Mountain, pass. Draw hand. Hit swamp, pass. Draw. Forest, <laughs> Okay. Uh, draw, and I will play a gateway plaza. Go ahead. Draw. Uh, play planes. Cool. Tap two for an Johnny's Pride mate. Ish. All right, here you go. Drawing. I'll play a swamp and pass. Okay. Yeah. Draw. Throw down an island and F3 for Arland Wolf. Nice. Go ahead. I will play an island. I'll tap three and I'll play the Spark Reaper. Pass. I'll tap. Draw. Mountain for turn. That's a 3 2 and 2 3. Hold this back. 3. Valduk, Keeper of the Flame. Pass to you. Drawing. Play an island. Yeah, we'll just pass the day. Okay, and tap. Keep draw. I'll tap four for a fire mind vessel. Nice. Go ahead. For two, I will play the Lazotep Reaver, mm. which a mass says one. So I will get the one one zombie army creature token. Pass. Untap. Draw. Gonna move to combat. I'm gonna swing at the god dragon. He's not keeper. A... The keeper it's like of the god uh, dragon. Swing at the guy with the empty Go ahead. Board. He's not <laughs> on the table. table. <laughs> and Tim, yeah. All right. Take two. Uh, second main phase. I'm going <clears> to <throat> play honor the god pharaoh to honor you. 
after I swung into. Discard a mountain <clears throat> and draw two. I'll create a zero zero zombie army token and put one 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 counter on it. Pass the turn. Alright, join. Play a swamp. Tapping four for Joyra's familiar. Go ahead, Daniel. Alright. Tap, upkeep, draw. Uh, it's gonna go blue green here. Uh, green for three to play Kiora. She enters with seven loyalty. That's a lot of loyalty. Yeah. I'm gonna minus one Kiora to untap target permanent. Untap That's... that guy. Uh, that was nifty. Yes. Tap this for a blue and a green. Two more there for Mawu, loyal companion. And go ahead. At the end of your turn, I will tap for blue and play Reach Through Mists, and it just says drop card. Nice. Draw. I will play a swamp, and for three, I will cast Divination, which draws me two cards. He's just drawing cards today. Who wants to draw cards? Joe wants to draw cards. I want to draw cards. Joe's drawing cards. Who wants to draw cards? I want to draw cards. I Go ahead. Too. Untap. I'll keep draw. I'm going to play a Mana Geode. Describe one. What is that? Mana Geode? No, that card. Oh, it's a card. Yeah. Well, it's what is a, it? It's got a converted mana cost. Mm. Oh, so it's not a land. Mm, nice. Past you. I'm tapping. Trying. <laughs> I'm scared. I am too. Did you hold a play card? another swamp? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad that Joe was uh, drawing That's a bunch cool. of extra cards. I'm gonna play Locust Miser. Oh. Each opponent's maximum hand size is reduced by two. So far. Right. Okay. Um, pass the Daniel. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. I'm gonna tap this for a green and a blue to play a snare spinner. Cool. Yeah. Then I'm gonna tap four here to play Tamio's Epiphany. Scry four, then draw two cards. How much does everybody want this to be gone? I don't want it to be gone at all. To me, it seems like I mean, of the things that are on the field, that is the most impactful. But Or this. Well, or I have zero this. removal, so I mean, are you, were you thinking about taking care of it or what? How many cards do you have in hand? Three. Oh, are you so supposed to that. draw two, Dave? I am supposed to draw two. Yeah. Oh, so you'll have five. So you'll be fine still. That, yeah. um, you only have five. You're fine, too. I will minus one Kiora to untap target permanent. Ooh. Fire mine vessel. Move to combat. Just to chip away. Um, Joe, I'll come at you for three. I cannot block. Right. I will take three. Cool. All right, pass the turn. Draw for turn. Sneaky little wolf. Um, I will tap five for the Eternal Skylord, which amasses two. So I will move my <clears throat> zombie army up to three counters, and zombie tokens I control have flying. And I don't want to run it into this thing, so, uh, John, I will swing three at you. All right, I will. Cast Jaya's Greeting, deal three damage to target creature. Let's cry one. Let's cry. Oh. I'll keep that on top. Pass the turn. Draw. Uh, play a land for turn. Pass the turn. Drawing. Play swamp. <sighs> <laughs> and then I will play Pain's Reward. What does it do? Can you read that? So, Pain's Reward says, you bid any amount of life. In turn order, each player may top the high bid. The bidding ends if the high bid stands. The high bidder loses life equal to the high bid and draws four cards. So I'll bid three health. A weak start, but all right. I'll bid four. Fold. Coward. I'll bid five. More. I'll bid six. More. 
I'm out. Yuck. Four cards. Mm-hmm. Seven life. That's a lot of cards. It is. That's a lot of life. You're taking six? Mm-hmm. There's no way you'd go eight. He does want a mountain, though. Probably real bad. I do. <laughs> I'll bid seven. You can have it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to draw four cards. I'd pay that. Worth it. <laughs> yeah, Two, don't forget three, to take four, a life. Five, six, seven. Keep in mind, you still have a maximum hand size of five. That's fine. <laughs> and then I'll play two and a blue, Flux Channeler, and then I'll pass to Daniel. Untap, upkeep, draw, cards in. Damn rat. Damnable rat. <laughs> for, the, for the rat's sake, I'll move to combat and swing three at you. Can't be blocked by creatures block. power two or less. That's going to be a Bolas killer eventually, guys. Yeah. Let's keep it around. Could be. I'm going to tap two for a guild globe. There's taps. I draw a card. Drawing a card. Oh, good. Playing a forest. And that's five cards. Passing the turn. Good for you. You got five cards in your hand? I do, yeah. Mm. <laughs> yeah, you better check. <laughs> <laughs> Three. Ashok. Ah, the Dream Reaver. I feel like I'm going to get spooked on if I do that. Why? The most that Kiora has done is just untap that thing and he's played creatures out with it. He hasn't done anything to upset and if the delicate balance that has been there is, there is a delicate <laughs> in place this yeah. entire time. I'm gonna get punished so severely if I target Daniel. You might. But he has 30 health. I mean, my library has nothing to do with that. Though. Yeah, it really doesn't. <laughs> I mean, a safe bet is to go for the... The bolus. The bolus. Oh, of course. <laughs> yeah, safe bet. Just go for Tim. <laughs> Always. Yeah. Or mm -hmm. the guy who just drew four cards. You get him yeah. that much closer to milling him. You could to death. mill him. <laughs> All right. The dice will decide. Oh, classic. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. Ooh. All right. Top four. One, two, three, four. Okay. And then. Yeah, we'll all of my opponent's yeah. graveyards are exiled. All right. Tap three and play a Naga Eternal, which mm. is a 3-2. There you go. Pass the what turn. are the abilities on that thing? Uh, it's a 3-2, and it has the flavor text. I recognize that headdress. <laughs> this one was feared even by her fellow initiates. Samet, pass. The end of your turn. I will... I can't. Um... <laughs> Well, I will deal two damage divided as I choose among one or two target cards. Oh, mm -hmm. two damage. There it goes. The Locust Miser. Draw. I am going to... I'm going to pass again. All right. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Shenanigans. It's a mob. <sighs> An island. <laughs> Hmm. I'm not looking <laughs> for attacks. Okay. I don't think I want to be attacking anybody at this point. He's <laughs> <laughs> so ripped. Oh my goodness. Pass to Daniel. He is? Look at that. Jeez, he's like a jacked little yeah. dog. Kimonas Theodosu. Kimonas Theodosu. Way to make a jacked dog. <laughs> Shout out to excuse you. me. Shout out to you. Alright, untap. Upkeep. Draw. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna pay green, blue, and three more for Nissa, who shakes the world. <gasps> She's shaking the world. Yes. Are you playing a, a Joe deck? Ah, it might be. I'm gonna plus one Nissa. I'm gonna untap this guy here. Three counters on it. Just hanging out back there. Combat? Yes. Three at ten. Okay. And I will down tick Kiora to untap the Firemind vessel. 
That's a pretty good little deal he's got going on there. I know. And I will tap three here to cast uh, Jace's Triumph, draw two cards. Draw two cards. And pass. Untap, upkeep, draw. Four. For the Herald of the Dread Horde. And uh, I'm content to just sit here and pass. Draw. Land for turn. One red. And two white to cast five. The lone creature commander takes the field. Pass the turn. Drawing. Oh boy. Is this the turn? Due to this effect, historic spells cost one less cast, so for two blue, I'm going to cast Narset. So she comes out with five counters, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Watch <laughs> two mountains be on top. Be. So the top four. I'm glad I did that. <laughs> Revealing Pull Under, which is an instant arcane spell. The rest. <laughs> of these non mountains yes. uh, nice goes mm -hmm. on the bottom of my library. And um, that's my turn. Go ahead, Daniel. Keep, draw. I'm gonna uptick Nissa, who shakes the world. He's only one away from Make this him. island a 6 6. <laughs> the counters have to go on different lands. You can't do on the same land. Up to one target non-creature land. Non-creature land, sorry. You're fine. Okay. Fix that. All right, combat. I'm going to swing three at Narset with Ireland's Wolf. <coughs> Tap this forest for two mana to play Vivian's Arcbow. Ooh. That's pretty cool. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Um, it's pretty good. I'm gonna tap s for seven here. What? Um, tap Vivian's Arcbow. I will discard Crush Descent. Look at the top seven cards in my library. And I may put a creature with converted mana cost seven or less from among them onto the battlefield. I put the rest on the bottom. There are, oh, there's one creature in here and it is a Thalid, a one mana Thalid. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, he's, All right. He's there. And um, let's see it. pass the turn. At the end of your turn, I will tap three and sacrifice the Herald of the Dread Horde to Spark Reaper to gain a life and draw a card and I will amass two. Nice. Untap. Upkeep, draw. I will play a Karn Bastion. Nice. Cards in hand? Uh, five, I think, let's see. Four. Four. Cards in hand? Four. Cards in hand? Seven. Uh, for two, I will play my Fallen Empires card, him to Turok, targeting you, Daniel. Okay. Uh, that's, that's fine. All right, Joe. Sing the hymn. Oh, I need a I like that, Joe. Okay, rescue and steady aim. Ooh. That will be my turn. Pass. All right, so at the end of your turn, I will pay five to cast Sarkhan's Catharsis, and I'm gonna target Nyssa to deal five damage to her. In response, mm -hmm. tap two for a blue and a green and cast Teferi's Time Twist. I'll exile Nyssa mm -hmm. and return her at the beginning of the next end step. Okay. This is at the end of my turn? Yep. Yes. Okay. So she's coming back with five counters. Bought us some time. Draw. I'm gonna pay you one, two, and five to cast Jaya's Immolating Inferno. So Correct. X is three in this X is three. instance, all right. Um, I'm going to target Feather as my first target. Okay. And nice. I will target Mowu, yes. Okay. And the spider. spider. Mm, nice. So Jai's Immolating Inferno exiles itself, 
And then I'll return it to the, my hand at the beginning of the next turn. So nice. I will pay one for a Defiant Strike targeting Feather. She gets plus one, plus zero till end of turn, and I draw a card. So I'll draw a card. She's plus one. And that's the same thing. It'll be exiled yep. and then go back to your hand at the beginning of the next turn. Very cool. So, yep. And I'm going to swing four at Kiora. All right. Kiora will die. Go back to the command zone. Command zone, <laughs> very close to the uh, other zone. And then I will uh, end my turn, returning these two to my hand. All right, that was pretty good. Untap. <clears throat> I'll keep draw. Someone had to tame you back a little bit. A little bit, just a mild pruning. Just a you still have Nessa. <laughs> That's true. I'll tap three. Or mana geode. <gasps> you know what this means. I do know what this means. Three and a red for goblin assault team. Pass the Daniel. Alright. <clears throat> Untap. Um, at my upkeep, I put a 1-1. One, one, spore counter. I, yeah, I put a spore counter in this, bro. It's a big glass cannon for uh, uptick. Nissa. Put a put three one one counters on another land I control. He's amassing quite an army. Yes, he is. I'm gonna tap five to play Kiora. Okay. Uh pass the turn. Before you move to your end step, okay. I'm gonna pay one to cast Defiant Strike, targeting a Johnny's Pride Mate. Um gets plus one plus O till end of turn. Draw a card. <laughs> Sick. And then I'm going to return this at your end step. Mm -hmm. Great. Also, at your end step, I will pay four and proliferate. Ooh. Untap, upkeep, draw, and pay two for Dreadhorde Invasion. I will move to combat, and I'm going to swing three at Nyssa. Mm. Yes. All right, she's going down to three. No, that's pass. three flying. Yes. So before your end step, Defiant Strike, draw a card. End step, take it back. Nice. Untap. So we need to get rid of that. Draw. More land. Two, three. So five, Jizen, Immolating Inferno. Okay. Targeting Feather. And this, uh, okay. And the zombie army. Okay. In response, I will sack the zombie army and gain a life and draw a card. I will pay two to cast Burning Prophet. We'll pass the turn. Upkeep draw. I won't attack your nickel wolos. We're all friends with Nickel Bolas now? Well, it's a means to an end. There's no there's no way on board to deal with what is the biggest threat right now, what's drawing you all these cards. I'm just drawing cards. Oh, I'm just drawing cards. Look how many of them are lands. Look at this. Lands and, and nonsense. I'm just saying. I mean, I will, Tim, I will not attack Nickel Bolas or interfere with him in any way. Nicole Bolas. The Elder Dragon God Emperor Pharaoh has arrived. So in response to you casting Nicole Bolas, mm -hmm. Defiant Strike mm -hmm. on Feather. I'm gonna scry one from Burning Prophet. I will draw this card. And then um, I will cast Battlefield Promotion. Um, it's put a 1-1 one, one counter on target creature. That creature gains first strike till end of turn. I gain two life. Yeah, so I'm gonna target Ajani's Pride Mate. So, um, I'm gonna put two counters on it because whenever I gain a life, we'll do that and then I'll gain two life. And then I will exile that and it'll come back to my hand at the beginning of. And so, Nicol Bolas can- Resolves. Be. Resolves. Mm -hmm. Four counters. Okay. I'm gonna play Cosmina's Transmutation. Okay. On Feather. Mm -hmm. Whenever I cast an eye creature spell, proliferate. Five. 
going to uptick the Kobolds to six. So I get the draw card, everybody exiles a card from their hand. I will exile a swamp. Or a permanent. Oh, I'm going to exile points. Guild Globe. And pass the turn to Daniel. Alright, at my upkeep I get another Spore Counter on this Thalid. Oh, you're getting so close the, to making a Thalid. The Doom of the Nations. Let us... Um, pass the turn. Pass the turn. Um, at the end of your turn I'll proliferate. Mm-hmm. Do you wanna... <gasps> no! Actually, you could use that to your advantage. You still have a Legendary, so sometimes you adding to my Nicol Bolas isn't necessarily a bad thing for you. You're safe. But somebody else might not be. At the current moment. Yes. He's still safe. Feather is still a legendary creature angel. All right, so untap, upkeep, Dreadhorde invasion, loses uh, me a life, gets me an army. Uh, I will draw for turn. For two, I will cast Vicious Offering sacrificing zombie army to pay the kicker and give the lifelinker, not the lifelinker, but uh, pride mate, minus five, minus five. And I will pass the turn. Untap. Draw. You have lost the most permanents, but you're still at 30. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. <laughs> All right. Uh, one, two, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, it gets a kicker at seven. It's just what it is. Oh. Yeah. We're going to do there and there and here. So Feather is going to die. You get that. Thanks. Or I don't know where you're sorry. That's your discard. There's your discard pile. And this goes back to my command zone. So, and then um, whenever I cast it on, it's a creature spell, gets plus one till end of turn, and I scry one. I should have done that before Immolating Inferno and resolves, but. So, I'm going to cast Tibalt's Rager. Pass you. Draw. I'm going to play Nicol Bolas. It costs one less. Then I will play. Spark Reaper. I'm going to uptick Nicol Bolas. Draw a card, nobody else gets to exile a card from your hand or permanently control. Exile planes from my hand. In response, I'm going to tap 7 and tap Vivian's Arcbow. Discard uh, Contentious Plan. Look at the top 7. And I will put Primordial Worm on the battlefield. Oh my god. And put the rest in the bottom of my library. When the Bolas thing resolves, I'll exile a forest. I will exile a swamp. Pass the turn. Okay. I'll get a extra counter on this bro at my upkeep. Draw. Combat. Seven at John. Is it a trample or anything? No. It's just straight up. I'll throw my zombie army in front of it. There we go. Pass the turn. On your end step, I will sacrifice the Lazotep Reaver, gain a life draw card. On my upkeep, I will lose a life and make an army. Look at that little engine he's got going. Mm -hmm. That's a juicy, juicy graveyard. A lot of juicy graveyards. I have no recursion, so I'm fine. Yeah, me neither. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Poor eedy, meedy. I got the mo before. Yeah, you got the mo before. Yeah. One through three, four through six. Uh, the top four, and each opponent exiles their graveyard. So Dread Malkin, Kiora's Dambreaker, a swamp, and Dredge Sentinel. Oh, yeah. Okay. Exiling. Bye, Nissa. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw. Five for Feather. Uh, I will counter that. Out of the sky! Yes, right, it's okay. I'm gonna pay five to cast Wanderer Strike, exile target creature, and proliferate. Okay. In the swift vengeance. Did you want to proliferate this? Nope. Okay. Untap, upkeep, draw. 
Hey, look at that, my first mountain. Yay! It's the foil mountain that you opened, too. I think this thing has to die. This, this thing? thing? This thing. His. Ah, mine's that. not. I'm not doing anything. So, two in the blue. Casting a, casting a non creature spell, proliferate. Mm. Um, hold on. I'm gonna target or counter Casmina. Okay. Oh, it is exiled. Okay. okay, I'm gonna put that on the bottom. How do you feel about getting rid of somebody? He's got a legendary. I've got a legendary. It has to be a creature of Planeswalker. Oh. How do you feel about you. getting rid of two players? As long as I'm not one of them. It's <laughs> pretty sick. <laughs> I don't see. Just let Nickel Balls resolve. Whatever. No big deal. So, one, two, three, four, and a blue, or a red, to cast Sarkhan's Catharsis. Okay. That's a non creature spell? Yep. So, this goes up to seven. And if you proliferate with Karn's Bastion, two players are dead. <sighs> I will proliferate and nickel bolas. I literally can't believe that. That's incredible. <laughs> I love it. Oh, ultimate nickel bolas. And Each opponent who doesn't control a legendary creature or planeswalker loses the game. Right, in response to that, I will tap six. Oh, yeah. Um, I will tap Vivian's Arcbow and discard an island. And oh, wow. Search for a legendary. Tap six. <laughs> He's hunting. I'm hunting. And I will put Emo War E of the Open Fist. <laughs> That was wicked. Come, come, Johnny. The punishment is due. RP1. I'm sorry. Because this is a historic spell for pris Prismite. Yeah. Pass to you, Daniel. What a right. save. <laughs> that was awesome. Untap, upkeep, draw. Um, I can't really have any good attacks. Um, I'm gonna pass. At the beginning of my upkeep, I'll amass one. So I'll just put a counter on. I was on back. I'll also lose a life. Draw. You stupid arc <laughs> <laughs> For I six, have... I will cast the God Pharaoh statue. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, I can't really attack profitably either. I'll pass the turn, and at the end of my turn, uh, you each lose one life. All right. Drawing. So I'll pay tap three for Shriek, Shriek Diver. And that costs five, actually, right? Because I've right. got Pharaoh's statue. Oh, I don't like that. Five. Pass you, Daniel. At your uh, end step, I will tap eight. Um, Tap the bow, discard an island, and look at the top eight. My god. Um, I don't love this, but I'll put Thundering Saratok on the battlefield. 4-5 Trample. Cool. Untap. That bow Key is draw. pretty ridiculous. It is. It's just a replacement for a land. And one of these. Well, looks like we're gonna pass. Untap. Upkeep, I lose a life and a mass. Draw. That's a four more now. It's gonna be a six six soon. Which means it gets lifelink. Yeah. yeah. Four. I, if... I am going to destroy. I'm gonna destroy the Chandler. Mm. In response, tap three to sack it to gain a life and draw a card. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Dan, I'm gonna have you do the top four. All right. Curator's Ward, Island, oh, Gift of Growth, and a Forest. And then Exiled. Exiled. Look at that, look at all those. And uh, I will move to my end step. 
and you will each lose a life. All right. 28 turns later. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I go. You will right. anyway. I'm tapping. I'll keep drawing. So Nicole Boloth cost me 10 now. So two. Minus one. Six. Minus one, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll just go ahead and do that. Ooh. Oh, uptick. Draw a card. Everybody else. I'm gonna exile something. Exile something. In response, I'm gonna take three counters off this thing to make it valid, and I will exile the valid. I will pass. Alright, you're end step. I'm gonna tap eight. Tap the arc bow. Gateway Plaza. All right, here we go. Oh, good. I will just... play Double Flip, the Lost, uh, and he entered from my library. I will draw two cards. And these two will go. Oh, nice. That's that was at cool. the end of your turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That was cool. Upkeep. Draw. Get another counter on this thing. All right, I will play a Memorial to Genius. Tap. And I will tap three for Vivian's Grizzly. Pass the turn. All right, on your end step, I will proliferate. Huh? No. <laughs> <laughs> that time is over. I mean, it wouldn't have any effect mm -hmm. unless we could get rid of his. Daniel's got uh, This, I will amass and lose your life. Uh, combat, I'm gonna swing six at Nicol Bolas. Flying. A block. Okay. With the Shriek Diver. I will gain six life. <laughs> Here we go. Second main. <laughs> I will play Bolas as Citadel. Oh, nice. Oh, perfect. Now that he's getting all that life. <laughs> and I'm going to look at the top card of my library. Amazing. That's a sweet foil, too. I will cast the top card of my library, which is an Ugin's Conjurant. It is an X cost, so I will cast it for zero. And it will die. <laughs> And now we can look at the next one. All right. If he wants. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> I will pass the turn. At the end of my turn, you will all lose one life. He's like, I don't even need it. Upkeep. Draw. Paying two for Kaya's ghost form. I'm going to put that on Nicole Bolas. <laughs> it feels so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Joe is just like, uh... Amazing. Ah, uh, hold on. I'm going to counter that. I'll pay three life. And okay. I will untap these three lines. Mm. Nice, nice. I'm gonna uptick Nicole Bolas to six. Draw a card. Everybody exiles a card from their hand or a permanent. Alright, in response I'll remove three counters. Make a phallid. I'll exile the phallid. Exile the swamp. Exiled a lot of swamps today. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. For Obnixilis, comes out with five counters. Go minus two, destroying the zombie army. And I draw two cards? You draw two cards, and then when you draw two cards, you're going to lose two life. That's a fair trade. I think I'm going to pass to Daniel. All right, here and step out. Tap six, tap the bow, discard an island, look at the top six. Get rid of that bow. Yeah. Do you have any artifact removal here? Do not. I will put out a Crunch Wrangler. Very sick. I think Daniel's gonna be running out of creatures soon. Oh yeah, I'm gonna run out of he's deck. He's gonna run out soon. of cards soon. Okay. Well, he's just filtering. Upkeep, draw. All right, move to combat. I will swing a through the three, two, four, five, and a five, five at Ashiok. All right. Um, before damage. I will pay three and sacrifice Ashiok to the Spark Reaper. Nice. And gain a life and draw a card. Yes. So True. That might draw a step, I'll lose a life too. Yeah. Uh, pass the turn. My upkeep. I will lose life and make a, an army. Mm. Draw for turn. Lose mm. a life. Up next list. Mm. Two, three, one, one, two, one, one, one. I'll move to combat. And uh, send these guys at you, Daniel. Ooh. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna block the 3 3 with 
Pebble flipping with it. Uh, Grizzly is going to give itself to the Naga. Sure. And um, that'll be that. Okay. Take two. And these two will trade. Second main. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And a kicker for ten. Oh my gosh. I will cast Slimvoda. Oh, Rising nice. Deep. Yes. Sick. Very nice. In response to that, pay three mana, sack Prismite, draw and card. Candle and draw a card. And then they'll come into my hand. Yes. I will also bounce these three lands to my hand. Oh, yeah. For their creatures. Pass the turn. At the end of my turn, you'll each lose life. Upkeep drawing. Pay. <laughs> that friggin' thing. <laughs> Do hate that. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, and a blue for Thunder Drake. Ooh. And then for two, three, four, five mana, I'll play the Spark Reaper. And that was my second spell, so this is gonna get a counter. Yeah, I'll choose any of those. I'll uptick. Nicole cool Bolas. I'll exile an island Draw card. I'll exile a forest. Play a swamp for turn. I think I want to get rid of that thing. Yeah, go for it. Makes sense. I'm gonna down tick Obnixilis to get rid of Slimvoda. Joe draws two cards, loses two life. Pass to Daniel. Alright, end step. Tapping seven for the arc bow and discarding uh, an island. <laughs> Running out of creatures. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll put uh, Bailoff Gorger on the battlefield. Tap. Getting low. I'll keep draw, losing the life. You should play Ashayok and just mill him out. <laughs> not the worst. The thought has thing. crossed yeah. my mind. I'm gonna go to combat. I will swing at Bolas. Three, four. I'll block the Spark Reaper. Okay. Tap four for a Crotch Wrangler. Can I play anything else? Oh, watch this. I'll tap three for a Thalid. Nice. nice. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> on my upkeep, I will amass one and lose a life. Mm. Then I will lose a life for drawing. Yep. For two, I will play the Guild Globe, which will draw me a card and lose me a life. Health's getting a little low over there. Yeah, it is. Sort of. <laughs> I'm gonna cast uh, Council of Soratami and draw three cards. Oh. Two cards, excuse me. Lose two life. What are you digging for? A way out of this? Oh, that's scary. I mean, if I win, it's not the worst thing in the world. <laughs> three, four. Disgusting shirt. You don't appreciate what great. Joe did for you? Oh, he brought you that chair. I do have a flyer. And this just dies. It does die. Uh, five. Skylord, mass mm -hmm. two. Uh, move to end step. Each of you will take life. one. Untapping. Upkeep. Draw. That's not what I wanted. Play interplanar beacon for my land. Whenever you cast a planeswalker spell, I gain a life. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Play full under. Target creature gets minus five, minus five until the end of turn. I'm gonna get rid of the Sky Lord. Mm. Then for one, two, three, four, five, six. Play Joyra's Familiar. Second spell of the turn, I get a counter. Uptick Bolas. I will card. exile. Exile Swamp. Well, exile Nissa's triumph. Lands exiled with <laughs> Nicol Bolas. I will pass to Daniel. All right, untap. Keep draw. All right, I'm gonna tap six. Did you lose life neutral card? Uh, I will tap six for Iwamori of the Open Fist. If you got legendary creatures, put them out now, folks. I do not. Wait, wait. All right, he's. Power four or greater, so I'm gonna get a one-one counter on the Wrangler, the Crunch Wrangler. Oh my! 
Oh, he's legendary. You're safe, that's right. You're safe for now. Uh, pass. Joe is not so safe. As of this moment. <laughs> oh, I am ass. Right, I was gonna ask you, so I was just waiting. Uh, for two, I'm gonna sacrifice this and add black and blue and play the Dusk Mantle Operative. I will pay one and sacrifice the Dusk Operative to play Spark Harvest and destroy Nicol Bolas. You wanna destroy up next list? Kinda do, but no. I will destroy Nicol Bolas. <laughs> so close. That was pretty close. You didn't have a counter or something? <laughs> For five, I will cast Ashiok. Mm. And down tick her and target you, Tim. Top four? Yes. Island descendant of Soromaru. Okay. Widespread brut brutality and mm. a mountain. And then you'll each exile your graveyards. There they go. <laughs> Tremendous amount a, of exile yeah, cards. I have, a, I have a deck exile of yeah. <laughs> I will pass the turn. Okay. Drawing. Oh, sorry, at the end of my turn, you all lose a life. I wasn't going to remind you. <laughs> Six. Tamiyo's Epiphany. Scry four, and then draw two cards. It's still good for six. Oh, crap. <laughs> all four of them are going to go on the bottom, and I'll draw two cards. Three for opt. Get a counter. Yeah. Scry one. It goes to the bottom. It's a big thing now. Drawing it's a big card. Guy. Play a mountain for turn. For six, I'll play Herald of the Dread Horde. Swing at Joe for five in the air. Pass the Daniel. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Lose a life. A counter on this guy. Imagine you won't play Bolas again, probably. Probably not. <laughs> 13. Yeah, plus tw <laughs> 12. Okay, I'm gonna tap 7 for Thundering Saratok. That is about it. control get trampled. Yeah. And I'll move to combat. I'll go everything at Joe. Um, oof. In response to moving to combat, okay. I will proliferate. Yep. Okay. And I will block here. Okay. And take. Lethal. I have Oof. to block here. Can't not block there. Okay. Go to one. Right. And draw and lose. Yeah, I'll go to one. Alright, this guy dies. Don't love that. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, yeah, pass the turn. On my upkeep, I will lose a life and amass one. Yes, you will. Smite yourself. Tim, it's just you and I. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, untap. I'll keep draw. Untap that. Oh, and we don't have to pay two extra man anymore. Yep. That is nice for both of us. Um, I'll pay a blue for high tide. Oh, interesting. And then I'll pay... Two, three, four, five. For the Eldest Reborn, mm. first chapter in the saga is each opponent sacks a creature, Planeswalker. Alright, I will sacrifice this salad here. That was my second spell, get a counter. For Cloud Reader Sphinx, oh boy. it's a 3-4 flyer, when it enters the battlefield like a scry 2. The red the goblin assault team. Four one with haste. Mm -hmm. When it dies, you get a one one counter and a creature I control. Mm -hmm. Good. And then one and a black for something that's missing from the table now that Joe's gone. Dread horde invasion. There we go. 
Wow. Things are looking good All for right. you, Tim. And we will swing with Joyra and Thunder Drake in the air. Okay. For eight. Eight. Take an eight. Oof. And it's your turn. Alright. Tap. Okay, draw his life. Where's the concede button? <laughs> uh, let's I see. Found it yet. <laughs> did you lose a life when you started your I, turn? I did, yeah. Good. So I'm gonna take <laughs> eleven regardless. I will tap four to play uh, Gaia's protector. The four two, so this is gonna get another counter. Okay. I'll move to combat. I'll swing twelve at you. We'll take four. All right. Mm hmm. Uh, you know, I was dead either way. I already did all the math, but um, <laughs> I'm going to play a centaur nurture and gain three life. Okay. But that was. Pass the turn, Tim. Right. So at the beginning of my turn, I'll lose a life and a mass one. The second chapter of the Eldest Reborn Saga mm -hmm. happens. You discard a card. And then for a blue and a black, <clears throat> I'll play Tyrant's Scorn. Oh. Returning. Guy has protected your hand. Oh, okay. You're mean. And then for... I like it. Three... Four, five, six. What else? What do you need? What I'll else do you need God to do? Pharaoh statue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and a pen step. You'll lose a life. And that was also my second spell. Okay. So this is gonna get up oh, to yeah. five. Oh yeah. Okay. I'll swing Just at in you case. In the air. I'll just swing at you with everything. Everything. Okay. Cool. Uh, the centaur nurturer will not block and watch as everything comes <laughs> back behind her and slaughters me. And that's the game. You're coming with me, Daniel. Bring forth the Janklor. You finally done it, Tim. Enjoy your reward. Hey babe, B?